Well, all morning, Spokane artists laid down fresh coats of paint, bringing yet another new pride mural to Spokane Falls Boulevard. Last month, vandals set the crosswalk on fire after it had just been repainted. But organizers with Spokane Pride and Spokane Arts say they got to work immediately after that, securing new permits and raising money to repaint the crosswalk. And they've done it just in time for the city's pride celebration. Bronte Sorotsky shares their determination to not let hate win. Despite a few yells and insults hurtled towards them, artists repainting this crosswalk say it's crucial to show that Spokane supports its LGBTQ community. You can't help who you are and we might as well celebrate our differences instead of fighting each other on them. When a small group of people yelled at this group working to restore Spokane's pride mural, their response was much more positive, blasting pop music and wishing them a happy pride instead. The amount of people that are for this versus the people that are saying hateful things, right, is vastly different. All morning, artists and volunteers got to work, putting paint to pavement to get this previously defaced mural ready for Spokane's big pride celebration on Saturday. Because we're proud of it. There are a lot of people in Spokane, the gays, the lesbian, bisexual, and everybody. It's important. The cost of fixing this crosswalk was $15,000. Thanks to people in the community donating and the Episcopal Diocese of Spokane matching those donations, they raised that money in less than a week. I mean, our theme is never gonna hide. We're, we're not going anywhere. And I think you have a profound misunderstanding of what pride is and the LGBTQ plus community if you're wanting to vandalize this. The city has extra safety measures in place to keep this month's pride celebration safe and secure for everyone. From extra security cameras to more police presence, Spokane is working hard so everyone can have a fun and safe Pride Month. And a new Washington law means anyone vandalizing a public crosswalk like this could be found guilty of a hate crime. Washington's new hate crime law goes into effect tomorrow. Reporting in Spokane, Bronte Sorotsky, 4 News Now.